And welcome back. The festivities continue here as we're about to make a gingerbread house. And we're joined by Miss Wendy Palacio, owner of Dainty Cookie Company. Palacio, sorry. Yes, that's Wendy. fine. <laughs> welcome, Wendy. Welcome. Thank you so much uh, for having me. We I'm have excited. Yeah. The full setup here. Yes. Um, we're architects of a gingerbread house today. Yes. Where do we start? <laughs> Walk us through what we have here. Okay, so... Here you have six pieces, mm -hmm. so it includes the two roofs, the front and back of your house, mm -hmm. and the sides. So mm. this is, look at that, that's so cool. <laughs> now, uh, let's talk a bit about your business while we are uh, getting ready to set up. Um, uh, you are the owner of Dainty Cookies. Let's talk about how long you've had your business running. So I actually um, opened my page in the ending of 2020. Okay. So I started making cookies, but just like, you know, for my household. Mm -hmm. And then the beginning of 2021, I started um, offering to sell. Mm -hmm. And since then, it's just been a roller coaster. <laughs> What made you decide to get into gingerbread houses? Because this is something that um, I mean, I, I don't, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. I, I always thought that you purchased this at you know at yes, the well, store. This is actually something new that I just offered this year. Mm -hmm. So I mm. normally make um, Christmas sugar cookie kits. Okay. Where you decorate Christmas. That's what cookies. I see more of. Yes. Yes, and um, all my customers were always asking for gingerbread houses. Mm -hmm. So this is the first year that I actually offered. Um, and my page. <laughs> oh, and how, how has the reception been? Uh, how have people um, been responding so far, to it? everyone has loved it. Okay. Yeah, so I'm thinking of offering it again next year, too. <laughs> you should. All right, let's begin. Where do okay, we start? Okay, so we will start with our house glue. Okay. And you'll grab your scissors and kind of make like a, like a medium-sized hole. Okay. Mm. Okay. Next. That's perfect. Next, you're going to ice the edge of your houses, like the house front. Mm -hmm. The house front is the one that has like the middle. Yeah, gotcha, that, gotcha. Yes. Okay. And you will. So. I mean, clearly you've done this before, right? Um, <laughs> yes. Sabrina, you're, no, you're, I have I, not. I. <laughs> I've never glued my house before. So you'll use the smaller, <laughs> the smaller square okay. pieces as your sides. Okay. And you'll attach it. Like that? So you'll put it on your cake board okay, so it can okay, kind of like it. have support for you. Oh. Oh. No? No. Nope. <laughs> Wrong or side, the smaller one. The smaller yes, the one. Smaller. Yeah, the smaller one. Oh! Yeah. That's some really good glue. Yes. This is almost <laughs> really <the> glue. <laughs> I call it my cement. <laughs> yes. Now everything that we are using here is edible, yeah? Yes, correct. Okay. That's right. Okay, so then okay. you'll take All right. the back of your house and you'll do the same thing and attach it to the to the other sides of your wall. Okay, there we go. Look at that. You know, I don't think I've felt this concentrated all week. I, <laughs> I feel like I'm in deep concentration trying to put this together. Oh my gosh, that's so funny. All right. Perfect. I think it's coming together. Okay, it's, coming, it's coming, Josh. Coming you got together. it. You got you it. You guys have the natural talent. Okay. So now you grab your two roof pieces and okay. you're going to line the edge wow. of your house. Okay. So that the roof pieces could stay stuck on it. Being full, guys. That's what I'm saying. So I'm saying. <laughs> did you did you do here? Yes. Yeah. Okay, got it. Oh, well, well, just right here. Just okay. Got it, got it. Now these are mini ones that you created um, just for the show this morning, but I understand that your package normally includes the much bigger ones that uh, kids know to love uh, to set up. Yeah. Mm -hmm, yes. That's correct. You know, so, you know, given the experience that you've had this year, since it's the first time you're offering the kits, was this something that you think you'll do again next year? Yes, yes. I actually 
would want to um, offer these mini sizes because sometimes like the huge ones is just too much to finish yeah. you know <laughs> so sometimes you just want something small to snack on also okay I think I got it I have to say I'm, you know, I'm kind of proud about my host <laughs> yeah your host your host looks solid as a rock yeah, okay. so now <laughs> you guys so. can decorate as you wish so okay using the same yes one. use Use fill your in the glue gaps. and fill in the gaps. Yes. Or as Rena, leak in, Joshi. You could use your gumdrops and just, you know, decorate. <laughs> hmm. 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 <laughs> what design do you put on a gingerbread house, um, Sabrina? So we, I, I don't know. I, I, and I'm very competitive. My coworkers <laughs> know, know that about me. Okay, let me see. I'll, I'll do marshmallows. Or no, let me do gumdrops. I think that'll be better. So you'll also notice you have a, um, another white bag that doesn't have the word glue on it. Mm -hmm. That one is a thinner consistency where you could... Design? Yes, you could. it's, it's easier to um, maneuver a design. Okay, got it. All right, now is the, oh, <laughs> what? <laughs> you already got your a, designs going on? Took a bit of a different turn. Mm -hmm. Now, please, um, please let us, let our viewers know, um, Wendy, that, um, Gingerbread houses, they're not just for kids. No. Adults could enjoy this it's as well. For adults, it's for fun for the whole family. Anyone could join in. Yes. Yes. Oh my god, that's so beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. How you doing there, Josh? Uh, not as good as Wendy, but <laughs> Yeah, I know her her I mean she's the professional. She, yeah, she is the professional. But you know, not too bad. Huh? Not too bad. Is this something that you could see yourself um, doing now? You know, I wish I bought a kit. I yeah. wish I bought a kit now. <laughs> Same. Well, I certainly can't wait for when um, Wendy, you decide to provide this um, in smaller, in a smaller kit. Yeah. I could see myself gifting these. I think this could be really fun yes. activities on Christmas Eve night. Yeah. I even like definitely, that it definitely. comes with an owner already. It comes with an <laughs> occupant, right? Yes, yes, it does. <laughs> Everyone has a little gingerbread man. So is this your first time making a gingerbread house for it both is. of you? Yeah, my and first time. Loving it. That's great. Whew. All right. I am loving the experience. Yes, you know, the holidays is all about making memories, and this is something that definitely falls in that wheelhouse. And everybody, I think, tries to find something different to do. You know, like yes. we're, it's always difficult to find something to do on Christmas Day, you know, yes. rather than the, the <laughs> traditional things. That's true. Yeah. Mm. Actually, let me go with my candy cane. Let's see what I'm gonna do with this here. <laughs> I know. Oh, I should have used that as my inspiration. How's it going there? Good? You know, it's coming along. It's coming along. It's my first time, so I'm not going to be too much about it. <laughs> not going to be tough on yourself. I know, but I'm watching you on Wendy, and you guys, you guys have really done this before. <laughs> no, I have not. <laughs> I swear I haven't. That is so true, you guys. You both look like you've done it before already. <laughs> After this, you'll be able to construct your own house. Yes.
I am so focused right now. Like, I just want my host it's to be. It's so pretty. I know. I see you guys decorating, and my creativity has run out all long. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, that is so funny. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, God. I feel like I need a tweezer. <laughs> so, other than, um, other than gingerbread houses, what are some of the other things that, uh, we can purchase from your business? Well, the main thing I focus on is custom decorated sugar cookies. Okay. So that's perfect for, you know, birthdays, baptisms, um, really anything, mm -hmm. anything that, that, you know, the customer or client wants, I could create. Is it too late to purchase sugar cookies? Um, for this year, yes, I've actually closed off for orders. I, wow. I've oh. been booked for the past, I could think, two months. <laughs> oh, wow. Yes, yeah, so now I'm booking for mid to ending of January. Okay. Well, if persons would like to uh, <laughs> book or reach out to you, how could, they, how could they do so? They just have to reach out to me on Dainty Cookie Co. on Facebook or on Instagram. Mm -hmm. I have an order form they could fill out, but they could also um, send me a message and I reply there as well. Okay, wonderful. Oh, what would you say has been the most popular? Because I know it's mostly sugar cookies that you do, right? Yes. Is there a, like a, a popular design that people go for? Um, well, the most popular I would say is characters. Okay. So, you know, mm. um, a lot of moms want, you know, a certain theme like, you know, Mickey Mouse, Bluey, um, right. Super Mario. So mm -hmm. anything that has to do with characters is always very popular. Your <laughs> 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 gingerbread man fell. <laughs> My gingerbread man fell. Okay. That's yummy, actually. So there's a lot of gingerbread houses that aren't really edible. Like most most people, you know, make them super hard or oh, the molasses okay. is yeah, so strong yeah. and the ginger. And I worked really hard on making this a really good tasting gingerbread. Um, oh, yeah. really? Yep. Yes. Yeah. You know, I've actually never had uh, or never tasted a gingerbread house before. So I'm interested to see how it actually tastes. Yes. How are we doing there? Well, I'm having fun. Regardless of what you think my house <laughs> looks like, like, I'm what? having fun. I'm that, that, having that's, fun. That's, <laughs> that's really what matters, right, Tom? Yeah, it is. Well, I have to say, uh, Wendy, thank you so much for stopping by and allowing us to, to really look into our inner child and get a these decorations <laughs> going along of um, course i know that a lot of people will be enjoying uh, creating gingerbread houses uh, with their families um this year hopefully we're able to save this segment and look back and say okay now we have to purchase our sugar cookies or gingerbread houses definitely, for next year definitely. or you can still choose to do it mid-January if you missed it. <laughs> Is that's that something true, you're open true. to? <laughs> that's true. Okay, but don't don't go in too long and it or else it look bad. I'll put this guy in front. All right. I'll you take guys it. Are amazing. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. Oh you know what? My last touch will be let me see. Oh, it looks like some snow falling down on this. Mm. Oh, that's a good <laughs> idea, yeah. I'm gonna put some. That's true. Mm. 
One second, I'll show you my masterpiece when I'm done here. The great reveal. <laughs> wow. The great reveal. The the um the glue is really doing what it's supposed to do. Yep. <laughs> All oh, right, this is my house. <laughs> really beautiful. No, no, mind my little guy. He <laughs> fell on the table a second there, but um, uh, I, look at the detail on the side here. Wow. Yeah, yeah. 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 These yeah. are the lights, by the way. These are my Christmas lights. These are like real expensive lights too, Very because nice. when you see the light bulbs bigger, it, that's because they're pricier. <laughs> yes, and these are my solar panels as well. The side there, that's what I'm using to light up my lights this Christmas. You have to love a tall roof. Yes, exactly. Windows, a nice door. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Let's let's talk about your, um, your house. Let's not. I'm <laughs> I'm, I'm just kidding. I, I mean, simple is great, right? Yes, yes. Um, as long as the guy is happy living in there, uh -huh. I'm fine. Uh -huh. I had a good time making I it. I agree. I agree. But look at this beautiful home. All the hearts on the side here. Oh, my goodness. Oh, you even put windows. Did I? Yes. No. I, shoot. I should have put windows. But All you right. guys have the candy canes going, so. Okay. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So you're yeah. good. <laughs> this is so beautiful. Wow, look at, look that. at that, guys. Wow. Look at the detail. <sighs> All this and more you can purchase uh, later on in the year. Yes, yes, yeah, later yeah. On. Next year, early next year. Yes. <laughs> but uh, thank you so much for allowing us to have this experience with you. Um, this was uh, myself and Josh's first time making gingerbread houses. I'm certain this might be something that you'll add to your. It's Christmas not going to be experience. the last time. Exactly. It's not going to be the last time. It could be your new Christmas tradition. Exactly. Right. Yes. That, I think that'll be great. I think it's good for both adults and kids alike. It's a great. Uh, experience that you can have uh, uh, during Christmas time to create some lasting memories, some gingerbread house competitions in your households, um, and all of that you can get with your business. Yes, thank you so much for having me. It was so much fun having, <laughs> having done this with you. <laughs> Alrighty, thank you so much. Okay, we are going to be taking another break, and when we come back, uh, meet us over at Cellular World, where we will be checking out their deals and steals this Christmas. Don't go away.